What's up? This is Sir Benson here. Today we're going to do some Faction Wars. Faction Wars 21. Easily the hardest stage in the whole Faction Wars. So uh, we will see if we can take it. Uh, this is my last stage before getting Lydia. Lydia the Death Siren. Um, as you can see here, I got uh, 216 out of 219. And I got uh, I have 3 starred everything. So I only got this one left. And it was actually... I think the second stage, a st second faction that I came all the way to the last boss, and it's been waiting for me all this time. So we will see if I can get Lydia. Lydia is a crazy character. Uh, she got uh, poison sensitivity, fear, um, increased speed, decreased defense, strength, and uh, yeah, she's she's just a crazy character. Uh, but the crazy, craziest thing is actually uh, that that she blocks revives, and it's and, and it's really good for the arena. And uh, she also increases resist in arena battles by hundred. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go over my team real quick. Um, I'm gonna uh, go with. Uh, uh, let's see where they are, Knight Revenants. Here we have them. Verlin Frost King, King. I actually I actually six star him and level him up just for this one. Uh, I'm gonna go with one Skull Crown. Uh, I have pus pushed in some HP on her and a stun set. Uh, I'm gonna go with Sepulcher for the decrease attack. That is super important. So don't miss out on that one, guys. And Doom Priest is also golden in this in this stage because she cleans the fear off all the time. And Miscreate the Monster, he's um, yeah, he's a monster. I actually leveled up uh, both Golden Reaper and um, and uh, Skull Crown for this stage, but I'm not gonna use them. My other Skull Crown. Um, yeah, so let's go into the to the stage and see how how long it will take. Yeah, I have a team set up here. I actually did this stage for uh, last time it was open. So uh, I have my uh, team team set here. I actually have. Uh, I was pretty close to to killing the boss, but um, but I had to uh, to get full uh, full masteries in Doom Priest uh, and uh, and uh, full mastery on, on uh, full masteries on on, on Verlin too. Right here, we can auto easily. It's uh, it's uh, it's no problem. Um, I just need to stop before the end, so he doesn't waste that skill. All right, so. Uh, Trying to get decrease attack on him, yeah. Got it up. The best thing here is to get Doom Priest as l with a, as little crit as possible because uh, if she crits, she will place a buff on one of your allies, and then Valkyrie will increase turn meter, and that is not what we want. We want uh, a, as little buff here as possible. Yeah, let's hope for the stun. Yeah. Good. Miss Great Monster. One of my fa favorite characters in the game, actually. Uh, yeah, let's go off on, on one, one, one Valkyrie. Can't do much about that one. Uh, let's try to stun that one with the biggest turn meter. Perfect. Uh, freeze on that one. Nah. Damn. Decrease attack. Yeah, he's got it up already. Come on, come on, stun now. Ah, oh, no stun. Damn it. Come on. Okay, stun there. But since we got some HP on Skull Crown, we can still sur survive these first, uh, these first um, uh, attacks here. So, but let's try to freeze that guy. No. 
Yeah, it's okay right now, but this is the tricky part. Oh, we got so many off. We can still do it. No, he steals a buff, of course. Well, we have to go again. Yeah, so now when we come here, it's uh, what we want to do actually is just place decrease attack all the time on, on the main boss. Because he will transfer all his debuffs to us and he hits pretty hard. Uh, but, but he transfer his debuff, uh, he hits first, then he transfer them. So, uh, 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 so it's it's actually okay to uh, to get decrease on attack on us uh, for for that ex exchange because Doom Priest will cl will clean them off right right away, and uh, on this boss um, um, he will he will steal all buff also. So uh, so be uh, be careful and watch the watch this skill up here. This uh, when when this one com comes down to one. The turn after, he he will steal all buff and uh, and uh, give us all his debuffs. So be careful about that one. Uh, uh, this one I will I will explain explain la later. So, but uh, but here we go. Now we just want to kill the ads uh, around here. He places provoke and he places leech. So just nice to to stun them all the time. This buff comes up, but but it's not that important actually. So. Uh, just try to place as little as the little as as little with debuffs as possible. So only decrease attack on the first turn. Got resisted right there. Yeah, there we see uh, she she cleans it off. Now we can place increase attack because because now it's three turns until he will steal us all 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 our buffs. Uh, this one don't use it at all. With uh, with miscreate monster because if he steals it, this will kill miscreate monster straight away. We 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 can't clear clear it without that skill. Uh, yes, let's go with that one. Exchange HP next turn, I think, because then exchange the HP with with the one that that got highest HP percentage. Uh, I should say because uh, yeah, he's gonna get back to full, and uh, and one of mine is gonna have like this this left. Too bad I don't got any turn meter here, yeah. turn meter uh, control on on this guy. With the night elves, I used, uh, of course, um, cold art. So yeah, there we go. Just need him to survive here. Can be pretty tough here. 
I'm not going to use this one because then he will steal it straight away. I've done that mistake a lot of times. So, but uh, let's hope that he heals some of this. I maybe should use the shield. Yeah, too late now. Uh, yeah. yeah. Come on, survive now, Miss Creative Monster. Yeah, nice. Okay. Uh, let's use this once only to heal up with Miss Creative Monster. No weaken off there. Uh, let's go with this one for the damage output on the. Uh, on the Whirling, increase attack. Uh, yeah, we can place this one. Yeah, and after the swap, he's gonna. We we right now we have ten turns on us to kill him because then he's gonna swap again. So uh, this is where I failed the last time. So, but uh, I hopefully will take it now when I have some 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 better gear on on Whirlim and uh, and full mastery on Doom Priest. Here we go, guys. Boom! Faction War cleared. Uh, and we got the um, sacred, uh, sacred charm. And uh, here we got Lydia. Don't know. Should I wait, wait, wait until tomorrow for, to uh, to collect her? No, I do it for the video. Here we go, guys. Uh, where is she? God damn it. Here we have her. Ooh, nice. Super hyped about this one. Uh, the nice enemy revive attempt. This works even if this champion is dead. Then she, she, she will get revived. If this champion is alive when an enemy revive is denied, revise all dead eye, all, all dead allies with 50% HP and 50% turn meter, grants an extra turn instead if there are no dead allies. If this champion is dead when an enemy revive is denied, revives this champion with 50% HP and 50% turn meter. This is crazy. Uh, and how many books to book her out? 4, 8, uh, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, I have uh, 13, 14, 15. I have actually saved up a, a couple of books right here. So let's see if I will book her out. Well, guys, many thanks for watching the video. Um, like and subscribe to my channel. And um, yeah, comment down below, which is the hardest faction do you think? Bye.